right guys, so we are here at the premiere for Star Wars Episode 7. We've been waiting for this. For how long now? Ever since it was announced. Yeah, a couple years now, and it's finally out. Super excited, as you can see, we are fully dressed. Yes, sir. Um, it's definitely hot as hell inside. Yeah, so that's so why we're, we're outside, outside right now because we're enjoying the cooler while we can before the movie premieres. And while we're on that, apparently theaters have a really stupid policy where you can't bring lightsabers with the blade on it inside. But we can bring these in, which is the hard piece. Yeah, which is but crazy. But we can't bring the soft plastic it, part in the movie. <laughs> and it's crazy because that rule just got put up maybe a week and a half ago, they said. And about two weeks ago, we looked it up and we made sure that we could bring our sabers in. And no. Just kidding. So, but yeah. Can't wait for the movie to start. It starts uh, pretty soon now, so... Uh, You're checking your watch. I know. Have a watch there. <laughs> I know. I keep looking for my watch. My, me too, but it's out there. So we're just having a death stick. Yeah. We have to be Real careful quick. not to drink too much, though, because once you put this on, and if you have to use the restroom, it's going to take a really long time to get it back on, and we don't want to miss too much of the movie. At all. Like, at all. At all. Like, so. and I don't want to hold my bladder for two hours, you know? <laughs> so we got to be careful. So probably just going to have soda or whatever, maybe like a little Yeah, snack. something like that. That's about it. But yeah, guys, we'll let you know how it is, how we like it after, and uh, we'll give you a review. YouTube. Peace. <laughs> Die tonight. <laughs> wow. It was good, just a heads up, but we just have to take it, this in for a second. It was amazing. Like, if you haven't seen it yet, you're gonna love it. Like, genuinely, I mean, it, it takes, like, I'm a big film guy. It takes a lot for a movie to make me cry in a good way. And it took every will on my body to not walk out of that theater just bawling. It, it was perfect like I don't know what else to say other than just go see it <laughs> it was an end to a great night I mean we started in the morning with watching the original trilogy and to end it with this it was amazing I mean <laughs> oh man yeah <laughs> I, I still can't believe we just saw a, a new Star Wars movie I know and it was extremely it, good it, it was so amazing like <laughs> and it was surprisingly funny too yeah, it, it was, it's got everything in there. I mean... Everything you want... Everything. ...to be in a Star Wars movie, it has it. But we're gonna um, head back to his place real quick so we can do a more in-depth review, and then later we're gonna do a spoiler video on that. So stay tuned on my channel for that. We'll see you guys in a bit, and uh, we're gonna be here for a couple more minutes just trying to yeah. let it sink in. <laughs> <laughs> All right, see ya. Oh boy. Star Wars The Force Awakens. Star Wars The Force Awakens. <laughs> awesome movie, man. <laughs> yeah, in, in short, yeah, it was good. And you should definitely go see it. Uh, and also, this is going to be a spoiler-free video, just a heads up, so we're just going to be talking, not necessarily specifics, but what we liked about it, things we disliked, but we're not going to go into too much detail, obviously, but this will be spoiler-free. We're going to make a separate video talking about the spoilers, so stay tuned for that. For now, we're just going to be talking about what we thought of the movie as a whole, so I don't know where to start. Where do you want to start? Uh, I mean, it's got everything. Uh, I mean, it hits every emotion that you want it to. Uh, it looks fantastic. Uh, I mean, <laughs> the picture quality is amazing. Um, I mean, there's... The effects, like the, yeah, the practical the effects. effects and stuff. You almost can't even tell that it's a movie. Uh, I mean, <laughs> it's the way Star Wars should have always been. Um, granted, the technology wasn't out yet, but now that we have it out, it's it's amazing, so... It has um, everything Star Wars fan one has awesome lightsaber duels, epic dogfights, and 
epic uh, just laser shootouts, epic characters, epic storyline. What I really liked about this is that um, the movie kind of hooks you in right away. You're like, ooh, interesting, because that's what a good film should do. And then it kind of slows down a little bit. And like, oh, okay, this is a good breather. And then shit starts hitting the fan. You're like, okay, it's picking up. And then stuff gets, gets more and more dark, I thought, as the movie went on. Yeah. Like, just as, as it kept going, things just kept getting more, I guess, I emotional. Mean, it, yeah, it just gets more emotional. Um, I mean, it's hard It's hard to do this review video without saying anything. Um, <laughs> but it, it's definitely something you need to watch if you have not watched it. Mm. Um, Even if you're not a Star Wars fan, like... If you just appreciate films in general, I mean, the the way it's filmed, and whoever is the choreographer, holy shit! Like there yeah. were some shots in there, I was like, that looks, that's eye candy. Yeah, it, it, <laughs> it it's just really hard to describe how we feel about it right now. Um, it's still soaking in. Yeah. Um, I mean, and and it, it's it's an amazing movie, but soaking in the fact that. It, it brings out so many emotions in you. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, obviously from the trailers, you see that you know Harrison Ford is back. So I mean, it's just oh, that's man. one when of the he things. Went on screen, the audience just it's, went nuts. Yeah, I mean, it's just one of those things where it just brings back the memories, and mm -hmm. it's like, you know, wow, throws you back, and um, you know, it, it's it's hard. Like I said, it's hard to say too much without saying too much. Yeah. Um, do us a favor. Don't post any spoilers on this thread or comments or anything like that. People still will. So just if you don't want to be spoiled, then just don't read I the would, comments. Yeah, I wouldn't read any comments. But yeah. <laughs> so I mean, definitely worth the watch for anybody, for non-Star Wars fans, Star Wars fans, of course. Um, people that are just getting into Star Wars, it's definitely mm -hmm. something you want to watch. Uh, you want to watch all of them, though. Watch all six of them. Otherwise, the, you won't know what the hell is yeah, going you, on. Yeah, you really won't. <laughs> um, but definitely, there's a lot of surprises. Mm -hmm. um, good surprises. Yeah, very. Uh, there was only like a couple little things. Maybe actually, there was only one thing that you know we thought could have gone differently. Um, but overall, it turned out great. Mm -hmm. So I mean, it's just it. Yeah. I thought all the characters were great. Um, you got John Boyega. You could tell he was super into it. I thought he did a fantastic job as Finn. No complaints about his casting whatsoever. I thought he did a fantastic job and delivered his lines like on point for every scene, I thought. You could tell he was so into it and so excited to be in it. Like, yeah, every, he was really, everyone... really trying to deliver. And, and Ray, whenever, uh, or Daisy Ridley, whenever she was in a scene, she just stole the whole movie every every scene she was in just and it's stole. not like overwhelming either you just yeah. like you notice like how into their characters everyone is mm -hmm. i mean it's just i mean it's star wars so who wouldn't be into their character but even they, the side characters really, yeah they really outdid themselves this time like i mean you were talking about uh the character poe and we like him because he's kind of similar but he, he's similar to pro protagonists we've already seen, but he's his own character. He's a yeah. new one. But in a way, he just seems familiar. Like, uh, he has similar, I guess, qualities, as I guess you could say, as previous protagonists have had. And I thought he was really good as well. And he was just a side character. Yeah. Um, there's certain characters that we're not really going to discuss in this video, but we thought could have been done a little better. But 99% of the characters, I thought, did a fantastic job. And Kylo... Fucking Ren. <laughs> Adam Driver just nailed it. He took the movie and was like, "This is mine." Like when he was on screen, like I could not take my eyes off the screen. Yeah, like he, the he, the he entire character it. is just <laughs> it's crazy. He's um, interesting and he's menacing. But what I really like about him is that even though he's evil and you don't condone the actions he does. You understand why he's doing them. Mm. I, I almost felt bad for him. Like, he's a very... He's unique. He's, it, it's yeah. slightly different than anything you've seen before. So. He's a very conflicting villain, you know? And I just really like how we don't agree with what he does, but we definitely understand why. And that yeah. makes a great villain. It really does. Mm -hmm. I mean, with that being said, I think uh, that's really all we can say right now. Um... <laughs> 
other than, you know, 12 out of 10. <laughs> um, I mean, I'm just, two, I'm exhausted. I'm going to give it uh, two lightsabers out of two. Yeah. <laughs> two out of two lightsabers. Two lightsabers up, I mean. So, yeah. I'll watch it, guys, and it's obviously way better than the prequels. For those of you that hate the prequels, you're going to love this one. With that said, here you go. Oh, yeah. Go and watch it. You guys are going to love it. Yes, it's sir. Nice little poster right there. That That's actually in the movie, by the way. Yeah. That entire scene right here is, is captured from the movie. Well, yeah, it's from the trailer. So, so <laughs> yeah, it is. But that yeah. scene was done really well, as pretty much every other scene was done pretty well. But go watch it, guys. You won't be disappointed, I promise. And thanks for watching, and as always, may the force be with you. Always.